everybody. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today, we're going to be talking about how insecurity can affect your desires. What are the ways that these negative thoughts about yourself can affect the desires that you have? What do you think about this, Akshay? This is a very, very good question. Actually, we is a relevant and important question because, uh, you know, a lot of people uh, don't really sort of like have huge goals, goals that uh, sort of you have to really work for it and you it's not like you know it, it, things that you won't get from instant gratification things that like you the only way to get gratification is your delayed gratification so uh, sort of uh, like for example a lot of people they don't, don't learn language because you know like it takes years to at least you know months to get you know sort of good years to uh, you know get uh, fluent and uh, you know, people would just say, hey, like, I just don't have a language gene for this. And the reason they do, they do that is because, uh, you know, like, they're insecure that they uh, they will not be able to do it. And uh, because they're insecure, they, they uh, the problem with delayed gratification is if you don't know you'll get delayed that gratification for sure, that means you, you're going to put a lot of work into this, but then uh, you might not get anything out of it. And that might just be like a sunk cost. And would you still be okay with that? And uh, because of that, you know, we really limit our desires. Uh, we only limit uh, we limit the desire into like only the things that we can see, things that are like that are very realistic. Where you know, again uh, talking about intuition and uh, insecurity when we talk about gut feeling, you know. So when I say realistic, are we really talking about like realistic stuff? Maybe we're just like talking about uh, you know like. If real, uh, realistic is like sort of like the middle, what if we are, we are talking about like uh, some basement floor, something like that. So, uh, so that's why uh, you know insecurity is a huge cause in terms of you know, like uh, not having desires, not having goals, not having objectives. Yeah, it's definitely an issue. Yeah, you covered it really well as to why insecurities change the way you think and therefore limit your desires that you might have and you know honestly not much more to add if you feel like if you're insecure about something you're no longer going to want to dream as high or achieve as high in that realm because you are limiting yourself with negative thoughts uh, that are due to your insecurity the fear that comes from the insecurity so it makes sense we have talked a lot about uh, insecurity and how uh... It can go. It can go in relationships. It can like you know, you know, affect your desires. Let's talk about something positive with insecurity. Uh, you know, you know what? Can we do that for tomorrow? Let's do that. Okay, sounds good. See you tomorrow. Oh, you're still here. Well, thanks for getting to the end of the video. Hey, while you're still here, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get new updates when we post videos. Also, make sure to check out these equally exciting videos as well. Have you pressed it yet? Come on, you have five seconds left. Three, two, press it now.